Hello subscribers and new viewers. This is Toys1252. Uh, a mail day today. But first a shout out to Toys210 who uh, <clears throat> I met through my daughter when they were trading uh, base, uh, football cards. He got uh, was instrumental in getting me started in YouTube showing my toys and also uh, getting my first Hot Toys figures. So shout out to Toys210, a uh, good friend and acquaintance on YouTube. So let's start this off with uh, opening this little package here. Let's see. I got this from Clover Enterprises off of eBay. This is for my Bruce Wayne figure. Bruce, come over here, Bruce. Oh, there he is, Bruce Wayne. Oh, wait, back up a little bit, Bruce. Back up a little bit, Bruce. There he is. You see, he's currently sporting the T1, uh, T800 Arnold Schwarzenegger T-shirt, which I borrowed from him. But I don't know, it doesn't quite look right. And besides, I'm going to get a, I have a, uh, I got a muscle, the uh, True Type muscle figure. So I'm going to use that for Arnold. So I had to buy a new pair of pants, a new pair of boots for Arnold. And I'm going to use his t-shirt. It takes to take that back. So this is, uh, may not be movie accurate for uh, Mr. Bruce Wayne there when he goes out in his first jaunt with his Harness, uh, but it looks better, I think, than the t-shirt, so uh, I bought that. It's actually a military sweatshirt, but I think it'll, oops, it'll do well for the Batman or for Bruce Wayne. So that's where I got that for. Oh, sorry, Bruce. So the t-shirt will come off of him and go back onto my Arnold Schwarzenegger. Is the true type muscle muscular body which is not the same as used for the Terminator 800 T 800s but uh, I guess it's closer than the uh, true type regular true type body so I'm gonna get I have ordered from Hong Kong the pants and the boots from the original figure and then uh, I'll use put the t-shirt back on there so that's gonna be my custom Battle torn Arnold Schwarzenegger. So this uh, box here has nothing to do with the figures, but of course I am a Batman collector also. So that's what this box is for. Let's take a look at it. Knocked over Captain America. All right, Cap. Alrighty. This actually came out October 2011, priced at $100, and I never pay full price, so I didn't pick it up then. Eventually went on sale. For about $60, still pricey for me, and now it's down to, it went down to 52. And with Leap Day 25% off, I was able to get it for 40 some dollars. So here we go. Oops. Let's see that. It's the Batman Files. Batman files. Boy, this sucker is heavy. That was the other reason I picked it up. Free shipping. So this is for people that are interested in Batman, other than just the figures. So maybe Wayne's Butler. I don't know if you've seen this, Wayne. Uh, Curtis. But you know what? I saw it in a bookstore. 
and I had to have it. There we go. This sucker's heavy. So. Take off the sleeve. And it's kind of has a rubberized feeling to it. Sort of like the bat costume. Oh, man. Almost like the bat costume, the feel of the, the material. Okay, so here's what it looks like. Oops. That symbol has a little bit of a something on there. Hopefully, I can get that off. Okay, the bat symbol there. Okay, you open it up. It's got a flap, a magnetized flap, and this is the Batman files. So it has everything you need to know about Batman, his origins, 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 friends, villains. So originally $100, I got it shipped for $46. Barnes and Nobles, $52, plus they had the 25% off for leap year. So looking forward to lugging this around to read all about the Batman characters and so forth. So add that to the bat collection. This also goes with um, some other non-comic books about Batman. The Batmobile Owner's Manual that I have. Including schematics of the Batmobile. And then I also have Batman Murder at Wayne Manor. This book comes with a, all this stuff you need to solve a murder from from uh, Wayne Manor's past. With little clues included. Newspaper articles. Uh, other such things. Photographs. So it's a cute little thing to uh, test your Detective skills. Then there's the Batman Vault. Again, another kind of all about Batman, including some pullouts. TV series. Uh, all the way back to the 30s. And then, it's been out for a while, but I'm currently reading Batman Philosophy, The Dark Knight of the Soul. So this is all about Batman philosophy. And no pictures. Nothing but reading. Is there an illustration in there? Okay, so that's sort of my Batman collection, and it's mail day, and uh, still waiting on, uh, still waiting on the 1989 Bat uh, Batman. I found out from my distributor that wholesalers like himself will not get it until March 20th. I don't know if he's going to have it in his hands March 20th, or it's going to be shipped March 20th. But usually after he gets it, it takes me another week to get it, so I probably won't see it till April. Um... But I saved $25 and it's shipped in a separate box, unlike Sideshow Collectibles, who ships it in the, the figure box. So there you have it. Batman Files. Add to my collection of books. Thanks for watching. Yeah.